All right. Now, Josh going to shuffle and pick. What helps Obama on? Oh, the cross. What helps Obama unwind? Nickelback. Oh God. I don't mind listening to Nickelback. Yeah, yeah. some Nickelback. What yeah. helps Obama unwind? Pictures of boobs. That's Beauty. every man. Yeah. Every, and every that wouldn't make him unwind. That would stir him up. Okay. What helps Obama unwind? Getting old dumb. Surfdom. Because he's that's person. fucked. Whoever put that down. What surfdom? Who had Nickelback? What is the hell? So oh, I had Nickelback. He had Nickelback. What what part was fucked? The surfdom? Yeah. What is that? I put that down. Cause his skin color. That's fucked. What surfdom? Uh, no. Surfdom is we pretty much serve a lord on the land. Anything? No. You, yeah. Not for him though. Yeah. He's the president. Yeah. Everybody serves him. Right. Bingo. He wouldn't serve anybody, though. Yeah. Okay. He would be, ah, uh, go, ah, uh, control. I'm All right. Going on. It's your turn. Ah, <laughs> uh, is that? Oh, you, okay. What would Grandma find disturbing yet oddly charming? My balls. Malcolm's mom. Oh, God. Drinking to forget. MJ's gonna enjoy this one. Uh -oh. I think he'll get it. He'll get the. Uh, All right. <laughs> what would Grandma find disturbing and oddly charming? Beach. Rush Limbaugh's soft, shitty body. Uh, I say racist, but uh, yeah, that's not the point. I think that, yeah. What would Grandma find disturbing yet oddly charming? Bitches! <laughs> Bitches! Bitches! Bitches. <laughs> oh, mine's last. Batches! Biatch. What would Grandma find disturbing yet oh, oddly God, charming? Gosh, don't do it! It's hurting your face and jar into my ass! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I can tell Josh got that one. Thank you. <laughs> Take it, you sick, sadistic freak. Yeah, you're <laughs> such a sick bastard. <laughs> All right, Malcolm, it's, it's your turn. Oh, God, here we go. Uh, Blank is a soup. Oh. <clears throat> Words, Malcolm. <clears throat> Content, Malcolm. Use your ebonics. Say it with your chip. Use your phonics. <laughs> Use your whole <laughs> thumb phonics. Use what? words good now. Blank is a slippery slope that leads to blank. So you got to pick All right. Blank. Yeah. Blanky, 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 to the blanky. Blank, blank, blank. Bottom answer. Okay. Oh, gosh. Top answer. Bottom answer, top answer. Bottom answer, top answer. And these two fit together. You know what? It's Malcolm. So I'm going to do a throwaway. Hmm. Top answer, okay. You know what? I'm gonna that way when you're looking at them. Top answer, bottom answer. So that way you're gonna look at them like that, okay? Okay. So you just pick them up. Yeah, okay. you know what? That makes sense. Okay. Do it. <laughs> oh, you got your set the same way? Huh? That's the bottom answer. That's top answer. Yeah, bottom, top. That's the second. That's first. Yes. All right. Uh, flip around. Makes it easier. That way, when he picks them up, that's like the first thing he sees is answer number one. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Okay, great. Okay. So, Dick Fingers is a slow result that leads to peeing a, a little bit. <laughs> Out of all ten fingers! <laughs> yep. Dick Fingers. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm sorry, bro. Mr. Rage is a slippery slope that leads to a mind having a stroke. <laughs> Wait, what? Let me see. Mr. Rage is... Mr. Rage, okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> it's fucked up. Yeah. The ping whistle solo from my heart will go on it is a slippery slope to that leads to a, the realms of Africa. It's music, so... Yeah. Okay. That's the only way they fit together. Dick Fingers wins. <laughs> Dick Fingers wins! Really? Yeah. Yeah. All right, Rod, this is your turn. That was just a throwaway. Uh, I got rid of two cards I wouldn't be able to use. Uh, today on more help. My son is Dang. blank. <laughs> oh God.
God, what you got over there, bro? I, I'm, I'm thinking about playing it, but I don't know. No, no. God, let's play it. There we go. This is another throw away from me. This is another fucked up one for me. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna play it. Oh, no, I, I guess I'm on the police. Oh, bitch. Damn. Okay, Rod. Everybody's play, so. <laughs> you gonna get it, Lego, you get it. Oh, Lord. Today on Mori. Yes. <clears throat> Today on Mori, help! My son is. becoming a blue bear. <laughs> a monkey smoking a cigar. Brown people? Brown people. Nigga. Who had brown people? <laughs> How is your son brown people? <laughs> Remember, you forget white trash people pop up on Maury. No, what I'm saying is, how is he brown people as in more than one person? White trash people. Yeah. They can't word right. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I get by with a little help from not Malcolm. I wish I could say I get by with a little help from my friends, but you fuckheads seem to hinder me at every turn. That's why we're your family. Especially you. That's why you're, we're your family. We are your family. Damn. Shit. How you Did you play a card, NJ? Yeah, I did. Did you pick a card up? Yep. Fuck it, I want to hit time. You get stupid. Yeah, I'm ready. You ready, bro? I'm ready. Alright, Josh, everybody's played. Ready for football season. I get by with a little help from Children on Leashes. I get by with a little help from Vigilante Justice. Or, I also get high. Get high. <laughs> get, get by with a little help from Overcompensation. Were you overcompensating? No. Were you overcompensating? Yes. Yeah. 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 You're welcome. Thank you. Well, why does it make sense? Your ego can fill a fucking room. Just because I have an ego in a group doesn't mean I have an ego in real life. I said your ego could fill a room. That's how big your ego is. It's not that big. Right. <laughs> That's why you're overcompensating. are done fucking each other. Uh, what am I giving up for Lent? <laughs> Lent. Ugh. Malcolm's life after I take it. What? I just play it. Okay. That, that's kind of fucked up, Rodman. <laughs> I'm like, plug you, that's fucked up. I said I was just playing. I know, but the answer you gave was fucked up. <laughs> Because I don't celebrate mint. Me neither. I gotta eat. So, fuck that shit. Oh, it's not just food you give a for Lent. It's anything. Anything that brings you joy in your life. So, video games? Fuck that. Video games. Which is why my card is so good. <laughs> video games, Mountain Dew, junk food, masturbation. Yeah, that's so on and so forth. That's corn. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why I don't um, celebrate Lent. I don't celebrate religions anyway. Uh, what am I giving up for Lent? Cybernetic enhancements. Oh God. What am I giving out for that? Auto cannibalism. You get it, right? I get it. Auto cannibalism is you eat yourself. Yeah. As in, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Stuff that brings you pleasure. Oh. Yeah. What am I giving up for Lent? I know besides lollipop. I'm torn between cybernetic enhancements or auto cannibalism. Damn. <laughs> you want me to say it? If I could suck myself off, I would. Okay. <laughs> That's counted as okay. auto cannibalism. Okay. <laughs> okay. That's auto cannibalism. Yeah, but eating yourself. Yeah. Don't tell me you wouldn't. What? What? Yeah, but I thought you would have said if you had a vagina, you'd eat yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Sucking your own dick doesn't make you gay. Okay. Okay. It's just masturbation. Yeah. 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 No, it's just like that's how you came out with it. Yeah. Tell me, if if you were a yoga master and you could fit your own dick in your mouth, you, you wouldn't try it at least once. Don't don't say no. Don't say no. Because you're a goddamn liar. Oh, thank God you're pointing the finger at him. 
I don't know. None of y'all. You wouldn't. At least it would pass their your guys' mind. I played the fifth. We're on camera. I played the fifth. I don't care. I wouldn't do it. I don't, I don't care what people think of me. Fuck, if you do it, you just do it. Moving on. Malcolm and Cheers. Just do it like Nike. What goes on when you've got the curtains pulled and your bedroom door locked? That's none of our business, Malcolm. Next one, Don't call me Dad. That's not your word. That's Ron's word. Why does it got to be my word? Because Malcolm's not allowed to use it because he's so white. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Okay. Okay. Let me answer your question. Next from J.K. Rowling. Uh, that's the Rowling. The Rowling. Next from J.K. Rowling. Uh, Harry Party in the Chamber of Blank. Oh, God. Mm. I know. Uh, I'm torn the 22. Crap, I had a good answer for that. Crap. Fucking dang. Nah, this one's much better. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've got the perfect card, but I don't want to waste it on mouth. No, do it. Come on. Alright, everybody's playing some I Malcolm. swear to God, Malcolm. Normally, if this was MJ playing this card, that card would have won right there. I swear to God, Malcolm. <laughs> Watch him defy your expectations. It's funny. I'll see you, man. <laughs> That's not mine. Oh, damn. Wait, what was it? Oh. Oh, damn. Definite cleansing. Oh, shit. Wow! Ow. It'd be even better in the world of Harry Potter because there's so many different kinds of races and creatures. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Okay. Uh, homeless people. I'm gonna have to give the job because that was just brutal. See, he defied your expectations. I but was it because I called you out though? No. Or was it because that was pretty fucked up? Yeah, it was pretty fucked up. It was fucked, bro. <laughs> the Chamber of Ethnic Cleansing. <laughs> All right, let's see. Brutal. Pick two. Lifetime presents Blank, the story of Blank. Oh, shit. Lifetime presents the... the blank. The shitty story, the story of all time. Oh, my God. No. I got the perfect combo. Oh, fuck. And I don't fucking care. Uh, excuse me. All right. Top answer's going to be on the bottom, so when you pick it up, that's all you're going to see. Okay. Might be around. You gotta edit out. Might be. So this is the bottom answer, Josh. It doesn't really matter which order you put them. Throw away cards. Throw them away. What about you, Mo? Uh, which one is the top answer? Which one's the bottom? Bottom's uh, top, and the top is uh. Well, one, first answer is gonna be on bottom. One, two, yeah. One, two. Yeah, one, two. Josh, it don't matter. Mine is um first answer on bottom. Okay. All right. Lifetime presents the story of wait. Yeah, Lifetime presents Blake, the story of Blake. <laughs> a subscription to Men's Fitness, the story of a bop it. <laughs> bop it. So you said first second. Yeah, first second. Yeah. Okay. Lifetime presents Teen Pregnancy, the story of racism. <laughs> How is that a story of race? Oh, that's funny know. because it's just stupid. One, two. One, two, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Lifetime presents the Holy Bible. Oh. The story of the violation of our most basic human rights. Damn. Yep. I'm going to get at the mouth and that just... What? What? Which answer was it? Oh. The teen pregnancy? God damn it. I thought mine was... You were close, I, I applaud you. Yes. You were close, though. That's something I would do. <laughs> okay. Dang. Let me get back to the car. All right, my... Oops. I'm putting it on the pile. All right, my bad. Oh, my God. Don't do that. God damn you. Right. After the earthquake, Sean Penn brought Sean Penn to the people of Haiti. No, but Sean uh -huh. Penn brought blank to the people of Haiti. 
<laughs> oh shit. Band aids and cornflakes. <clears throat> a hamburger and milkshake. Donald Trump and all of his bankruptcies. No, Donald Trump wouldn't step foot in that place. Uh, he brought Kanye West there. <laughs> they brought three sticks at one time. Ah, we saw that card. You already wasted it. No. Sean Penn brought the greatest thing ever. Batman. Batman. Yes. That's great. I will heal you with vengeance. All right. Uh, After the earthquake, Sean Penn brought battlefield amputations to the people of Haiti. Look. That's just called life. That's just life for them. <laughs> After the earthquake, Sean Penn brought an asymmetric boob job to the people of Haiti. I can, uh... Just the one asymmetric boob job? Uh, wow, that's a lot. It must be a super boob. It's just like boob here. It's like, whoa, big boob here. Like D cup and then like A cup. <laughs> it must be a super boob then. No, it's like D no, cup. No, I meant like yeah. A boob job. No. The super boob. The one super boob. boob. A middle aged man on roller skates. Yeah, Polaroid. A Polaroid shake. Yeah. 
Alright, Ross, well, your turn. Right. See, I felt like if I if the joke was explained, I would have won. Yeah. Why can't I sleep at night? Oh god. Do you really want us to answer that? Take some Zequil, you'll be fine. I'm just gonna throw this out here. Take it at your pleasure. That's a throwaway card? No, 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 no. It's it, it it would give people a legitimate reason not to sleep at night. I'm gonna get rid of the throwaway card then. Alright. Alright. Everybody's played. Let's see. Let's find out why you guys can't sleep at night. Why can't I sleep at night? <sighs> the Care Bear stares. Horrifying laser hair removal accidents. Finger painting. Hmm, that seemed a little flat. Oh, who had the uh, hair removal? Me. Hey. The Care Bears there. <laughs> that would give the people a legitimate reason not to sleep at night. <laughs> yeah. I think they're creepy as fuck. Yeah. Yeah. Why can't I sleep at night? I have insomnia. Yeah, me too. Alright, Josh, it's your turn. <laughs> Might want to get some more of those light cards out. TSA guidelines now prohibit blank on airplanes. <laughs> make a haiku, but that's It could be the next. next card. It could be the next card, so we don't know what's coming. But there's a rule that says as soon as you hit it, game over. TSA guidelines now prohibit jobs on airplanes. Yeah. That explains why Steve Jobs plane? is not here. Who would fly the plane? Oh, wait, that's why Malaysian Airlines went missing, wasn't it? Because they prohibited jobs on the plane. That's probably what happened. Um, prohibit... Advice from an old black man on a plane. Uh, how are you going to survive the snakes? Now you see, young man, you see, young man. Pretending to care. Uh, I'm going to go with Samuel Jackson. Who had Samuel Jackson? What? Who had the advice from the old black man? Me. Now you see, young man. Because if they behave like that, how are you going to survive those snakes on the goddamn plane? I'm sorry. I don't know. Those Monday through Friday, those monkey fighting snakes on that Monday through Friday plane. Oh, stupid. Oh, That's as stupid as uh, having a dog shirt. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing but a piece of dog poo. <laughs> Nothing but a piece of dog turd. <laughs> oh my god. All right. Oh, Give me a second. I gotta reload the deck. Yeah. So just take some of those and then put these in facing the opposite way. What's bat? What is Batman's guilty pleasure? Dead there. Uh, no. Uh, that explains why I can't sleep at night. <laughs> <laughs> Dead parents. Because technically it is. If he wasn't filled with vengeance. <clears throat> Alright, anyway. Uh, Wait, why'd you throw that card down? Why? I thought somebody... No, we haven't played yet. It's my oh, turn. Okay. We haven't played yet, bro. God damn it. I found it. Oh! Uh, game over! It's over. No. We go a little bit longer. We go a little longer. Longer together. Hang on. Hang on. Let me take a bunch of these. Right. <laughs> Rise, we explain the haiku rule. That was the next card. Um, Damn it, Josh. Maybe next time you should shut the fuck up. Yeah, What'd I say? Yeah, you said it could be the next card. Yeah. And it was. It was that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Blank! But you can't have just one. Why you have three decks at one time? Let's go and get that out of the way. Is that throwaway card? Me? Yeah. Yeah, mine's with it. I think MJ will really appreciate this one because they're so good. What? I was gonna get my phone. One. They, those are no, so worry about good. It. Okay. Rod, you played? Yeah. All right, go ahead and draw. Have you played? Yes, I've played. You know what? Why don't you two go do something together? Like, you know, go build a fucking snowman. 
It's not wintertime, it's not snow. I know it. Jeez. Well, go build a mud man then. See, both of you agree on something. Now you can stop bickering. I'm sorry, bitchering. Bitcher. Make up your damn mind. Stop bitchering. <laughs> Whatever. You're arguing like bitches, so you're bitchering. <laughs> Don't be a bitch. Don't be a bitch. Blank! But you just can't have one. A sad hand job, but you just can't have one. That's <laughs> <laughs> the best kind of hand job. Filled with shame. And semen. More shame. <laughs> But mostly well, semen! Multiple stab wounds! Bet you just can't have one! Well, that's just in the name. Binging and purging! Bet you just can't have one! Not as fun as the other two. Uh, who has stab wounds? Me. Wow. I'm sorry, stab wounds just made it a little bit funnier. Wow. <laughs> it's like that much funnier than sad hand jumps. You had sad hand jumps, didn't you? Yeah, I did. <laughs> Bet you get sad hand jumps. Yeah, because I don't like jerking people off. <laughs> he dances with dicks. All right, Malcolm, it's your turn. Dicks are gone. I will. Dicks are gone. I will. You'll take it like a book. In L.A. County Jail, word is you can trade 200 cigarettes for... Should have saved that damn card! You <laughs> oh. oh. trade, trade 200 cigarettes for a sad hand job. Yeah, that was good. That was good. That was good. That was good. Or multiple steps. Oh man. There we go. Um, but it says, um, 
Every mission I lead is a suicide mission. Alright, Josh, all the cards are on the table. Yeah, Josh. And the cards are on the table. Yeah, Josh. Josh. And I feel like yeah. I'm sorry, Professor, oh, yeah. but I couldn't complete my homework because of frolicking. I have no idea. I'm sorry, Professor, but I couldn't complete my homework oh, because of old people smell. Are we, are we living at your place? Uh, uh, I'm sorry, Professor, you? but I couldn't complete my homework because of bioengineered assault turtles with acid breath. Was that you? What the fuck is that? What, the turtle? Yeah. No, no that was me. Uh, nice. Josh? Nice. I will murder you. So I would welcome it in this shithole I call existence. I was about to, uh, thought you were about to insult the bunker. Dear Abby, I'm having some trouble with Blake, and I'd like your advice. This is funny if you think about it because that's what happens when you uh suck too much penis. Oh god. You become Kanye? And you're asking a woman named Dear Abby for help with sucking penis when you <laughs> that is the background for my card. Okay. Dear Abby, I'm having some trouble with dry heaving. Yeah, you and I'd are. like your advice. Yeah, you are. <laughs> Dear Abby, I'm having trouble with concealing a boner. Yeah, you are. Dear Abby, I'm having some trouble with the same-sex ice dancing. I'd like your advice. Yeah, you are. Who's concealing a boner? <laughs> I, I wouldn't have owned up to it, but... Because <laughs> I'm the one who pulled it, so why not? I don't know. <laughs> That's probably why you're having trouble concealing it. Ooh, nigga. Remember, Rod, if, if you shake it more than two times, you just play it with yourself. Yeah, man. Yeah, you gotta remember that. Play a card! We have got time to sit and wait on you! Punch you right now. Punch you right now. I went to Broadway this season. Blank the musical. Blank the musical. Oh, this would be a fucking awesome musical. Josh would enjoy that musical. That's that's kind of what that card. Did you lay down a person card? Yeah. I laid down a person card. That would be cool too. Sean Penn, the musical. Oh, Kanye West, the musical. Oh my god. Nobody would go. The no. Kardashian tragedy. What'd you the lay musical. down? Oh, you'll see. David Bowie card? I'm not gonna own up to it, although that would be an awesome musical. Yeah, comments are probably this season. David Boy flying. Yeah, flying like a tiger made of lightning. Tell me that would not be an awesome musical. That's mine. It's just reincarnated David Bowie on a flying magical tiger shooting lightning just flying around the fucking room for, <laughs> for three and a half hours. Let this is hot. <laughs> After that is Landmines and Darth Vader. Darth Vader. I'd go see Darth Vader the musical. Uh, I'd just go see Dave Boy. He's more awesome. Oh, yeah, baby. Ziggy Stardust. Oh, yeah? Ziggy Stardust. Tell me, Major Tom, what's the planet look like? All right. What did I bring back from Mexico? El Chapo. Uh, I hope not. They're going to hunt your ass down. Thank you, you bro. Actually, you probably get a fucking Medal of Honor Valor plus whatever the fuck medal. You'd be the next Sean Penn. <laughs> He's mm -hmm. one of the most wanted men in the goddamn world. I know. Well, they already called him, so... Sean Penn caught him. Yeah, really. Sean Penn ain't caught shit. Yeah, he did catch yeah, him. See, I they know tricked he him into an interview. Yeah, yeah I know. Yeah, but then they said him. Sean Penn was lying about it. No. Goddamn it, Sean Penn. Sean Penn? Sean. Yeah. Sean Penn. Sean Penn number. That's a throwaway. Oh, no. All right, Rod. Tell us, what did you bring back from Mexico? What did I bring back Long from Mexico? Revenge. 
situation. That's what you Actually, my car would probably be an improvement. Yeah, yeah, he, you say? No, he said Montezuma's Revenge. Oh. It's basically diarrhea. Super diarrhea. White man scout. God, yeah. That's terrible stuff. Heteronormativity. Yeah. Okay. Hospice care. <laughs> Who had white man scopes? Heteronormativity was a slam on you. Mm -hmm. On me? In case, you, yeah, in case you didn't get it. He was calling you gay. I'm not gay. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't get it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Josh, your turn. I fucked up. I'm surprised nobody was like looked at me weird for my answer. White man scouts. What's the most emo? <laughs> White man scouts. <laughs> Jerking off in a puddle of children's tears is an actual white card in this set, and that's the most emo. <laughs> uh, shit, I'm just gonna have to throw one away. Yeah, let's go with this one. I'm just gonna throw away this card. Hand me a card, please. Give me a card. What is the most emo? Self loathing. Yeah, that fits. What is the most emo? The light of a billion suns. What kind of opposite emo? What is the most emo? Being on fire. <laughs> Who had self loathing? Me. Okay, you were on fire? No. I was on fire. My card was a throw card. <laughs> <laughs> so I won this one? Being on fire means you pretty much hate yourself more. You hate yourself to the point where you set yourself on fire. I can't imagine an emo being set on fire. Whatever. Just <laughs> uh, burn himself to death. I feel warm now. You had light of a billion suns? Yeah, it was a throwaway card. Oh. Okay. <laughs> A romantic candlelit dinner would be incomplete without Judge Judy. I'm gonna get this card out of my hand. <laughs> You're a man card. Oh, Fuck you. <laughs> don't worry, man card is an overused stereotype. This is this is you playing this? Yeah, I played that. So that means you're gonna whip out your best cards for me. I'm gonna whip out something disturbing if you think about it. Oh, Please keep your pants on. No, 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 no. This 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 card is a little bit disturbing. If you if you take a little bit to think about it, it's not funny right away. It's more of a disturbing card. Please don't tell me you're whipping out trout. No, I'm not pulling trout. A romantic candlelit dinner would be incomplete without destroying the evidence. Mm. Yeah, it would. <laughs> <laughs> the Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King. Martin Luther the King Jr. Mm -hmm. That's just Ma that's Martin Luther King. That doesn't say Martin Luther King Jr. Does it? It yeah. says Martin Luther King Jr. Oh, okay. Because if it was just Martin Luther King, that was his dad. It's yeah. his full title, the Reverend right. Doctor Martin Luther King. And Muhammad, praise be unto him. This is the guy they sent her out of South Park. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Destroying the evidence is the one that sounds better. better. Yeah, yeah that, that round was kind of flat. Yeah, it was really flat. Yeah. Who won that one? Josh, yay. Uh, you gotta destroy the evidence. Yeah, you do. Hell yeah, evidence gone, bitch. Alright, Malcolm, it's your turn. Yeah. Don't you dare fall asleep, I'm man. Not, I'm not, I'm not. He's giving us express permission to slot the fire out of him. If I was supposed to be. Life for American Indians was forever changed when the white men introduced themselves to Blake. Damn it, I wish I had the white man scout card now. <laughs> That would have fit real right now. Well, I, I guess this one fits because it actually happened. Man, the hard one to pick. It's beaches. What is this? Life for American Indians was verbal chain when white men introduced them to. Anybody got the Trail of Tears card? <laughs> that is an actual card, I shit you not. Yeah, I don't have it. It'd be funny to, yeah, it's funny. Like, T when TFS played this game, they played that card. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> Gotta love TFS. Yep, because that, that card right there pretty much... It's not funny, but it pretty much ruined their entire society. Oh, so did mine. Yeah. Alright, Malcolm. Alright. For life for Americans was forever changed when the white man introduced them to eating the last known bison. 
Oh. That fuck there. Yeah, yeah. Just yep, that, that was a food supply, basically. Sniffing, sniffing blue. Okay. Did the white man hat was glue even invented? No. Back then, no. I don't think so. Shiny objects. Okay. Yeah. If you think about it. Yeah, that did too. Oh yeah. Yeah, that did too. Yeah. Eating the last bite, no bites. Yes. Yeah. Fuck yeah. those I mean, buffalo. It's a, it is a uh, true fact. I mean, they it was John Marsden that did it. He killed the last known buffalo with the same rifle that, that was that with the same rifle that was used to kill Kennedy. Uh, or Car Carcano rifle? Oh uh, yeah. All right, Rod, your turn to play black card. White, white, uh, white buffalo. You need two for this one. Uh -oh. In a world ravaged by blank, our only solace is. Okay. Top card is on bottom. Dead babies! Kid tested, mother approved. Damn, that's so fucked, bro. Ow. 
dying. Kid tested, mother approved. That's fucked up too. Raptor attacks. That's fine. Kid tested, mother approved. That's fine. Who's got raptor attacks? Me. Oh. It's your raptor right. fuck. <laughs> Clean it up real quick. Clean it up the competition. Alright, Malcolm. Your turn. Wow, he's cleaning up better than that guy at your work. Oh, oh he is. That's going to be the end of Cards Against Fandy. Now let's call it tally. No, we know. We got to do this card. You got you to gotta make the haiku. Oh, no. shite. No. Well, that's fine. This is. Did you, you pick up your two bonus, right? Yeah. Okay, these are your two bonus, Malcolm. Uh, okay. Wait, I need two. No, I, I gave you two. You should. Everybody should have twelve. Okay, ma make a hard haiku like, card. No, I need two. I got ten. You draw two, and you play three. All right. So I don't know about making haikus. Me neither. Me neither. Good. No, you just pick three cards that you think. Fit no, I'm not like really making haikus. It's five, seven, five. Five, 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 syll five syllables, seven syllables, five syllables. But I can't count syllables. So I'm just going to free free make. Yeah, that's what, that's what you need to do. So we just throw out any three cards. Yep. I should win this hands down just because this one last card. Oh, God. Did you see what it was? Mm. Mine right, right. is probably not going to be funny, so I'm just throwing mine out there. What three cards do I think? It, what two cards do I think best express this card? Wait, substitute that one. <laughs> All right. This the. So wait, it, no, it'll be. Who played the haiku card? You me. Yeah. Okay, then we need somebody to decide the winner. I don't need to be playing with Yeah. Damn, that doesn't It's the third one, second one, first. Okay, mine's just one, two, three. Okay, so, one. when you're looking at them, what you're going to do is you're going to pick mine up and you're going to turn around and you're going to look at them. And that'll be... One, two, three. Yeah, yeah it'll be one, two, three, and you're going to... Same with mine. So, pick them up and then turn around, turn them around and look at them. Is that the way yours are too, Rod? Huh? When he picks yours up and turns it around like this, is that one, two, three? Yep. One, two, three. one, two, three. Okay. <coughs> All right. All right. Okay, Malcolm. Oh, right. I don't do mine first. Save it for last. Yeah, just because I laid mine down last. No, you don't have to. You can do somebody else's then mine, but just because uh, I know that you did that, like every time I was laid mine down, you'd be like, yeah, there we go. Should I know you'd be some happy? Fucked up answers, that'd be funny or fucked up. Anyway. Oh, that one's kind of cool. Because the the two cards I drew for the draw. Alright, alright, alright. We go. Yeah, go, go. Uh, we're all right. This one's first. The artist of Dutch. Extremely tight pants. My black ass. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Opposable thumbs. Being marginalized. This year's mass shooting. Wow. Okay. Mine put together. Mine ends with a perfect card. Oh, shit. Ooh, no. Getting really high. Not wearing pants. Cars against me. Oh, my yeah. God. Josh got that one. Yes. Wait, what did he say? It, mine was getting, getting really, really high, high. Not wearing pants. Cars against you, man. Damn. <laughs> yeah. Josh got that one. Yeah. yeah All right. right. So. Now we gotta close it out. Uh, real quick total, catch your black cards. Alright, I got ten. Ten. Josh, how many you got? Eleven. I got thirteen. I got eleven. Alright, so Josh is the biggest asshole. Unless you go for a recount. 10, 12, 13. Yeah, okay. I got 13. Josh wins it. He's the biggest asshole. Malcolm gets second place. Me and Rod tied for third. All around fun game. Uh, we're going to hopefully keep doing this. Again, it depends on work schedule. So We went through quite a bit of black cards, too. We did. We went through half the black card deck, and yeah. we had to reload the white card deck at least once. Yeah. So That's Cards Against Humanity. Uh, we're going to be, again, we're going to try to do this, just depending on how work schedules.
go. But uh, let's go ahead and shut this down, all right? Um, just to exit out. He is... <laughs> oh, what? I'm closing oh, out. I'm Pocket. He's Pocket. You are... Rodimus Prime. The biggest misfit. And you are... M -m -m mainstream I'm Robinson. No. And I'm War Machine MJ, and we will see you assholes next time.